Hi there. Um, yesterday, OpenAI announced uh, something they called function calling, um, and I created two prototypes to illustrate exactly what, the, what are the limitations and the capabilities of function calling. So function calling is currently available on these two models, GPT 3.5 Turbo 0613 and GPT 4 0613. Um, and it needs to be clear that um, OpenAI open AI, AI doesn't automatically interface with APIs or exchange information with, with, with APIs. What this model does that is that on instruction, if you tell it to generate a JSON output, it will take natural language input and it will populate a JSON document based on the parameters you've set up front. So there are two things to remember here. So instead of the model creating unstructured natural language output, it creates a JSON output, a JSON document output. And secondly, the model needs to know up front that it should create a JSON document and not natural language understanding. So there's an element of uh, classification or intent detection beforehand for the model to know what to generate. So I use the completions um, uh, endpoint or, or URL. I ran the, the tests in using Postman. And here is the, a request I sent um, saying send Corpus from Human First AI an email asking for the monthly report. Now, this is what I alluded to in the beginning that you will see that you need to define um, the, um, the name of, of, of the, 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 the um, function send email. The, the parameters of object, um, uh, sorry, the, the parameters of, of, of address, of subject, and of body. And at the bottom here, you'll see the response from OpenAI and the to address, and it constituted my email address from the user input, the subject request for monthly report, and a very um, well formed um, body of an email, dear Corbus. Um, thank you in advance, best records, and a placeholder uh, for the name. So what I find interesting here, it actually it generates uh, a type of a template you can use to, to populate with, um, with a name via prompt engineering and, and prompt templating. Um, a second example I want to just briefly look at is a, a travel booking example. So I say I need to book a trip from Bonn to Amsterdam for my wife, my mom, my two sons and my daughter. Um, I'll also be flying, uh, I'll also be joining them and the flight must be direct. Um, and again, I need to define um, the structure of my document and say I need to uh, populate departure, number of people, travel mode, mode and destination. And below is uh, a very well-formed document with destination, Amsterdam, departure, bond, number of people, six, travel mode, um, airline. Um, just uh, an indication, should you get your description wrong of your JSON document, then you will get the following error um, from, from OpenAI's endpoint. Um, so you need really to define your, your document um, quite well. And I think, I think the primary use cases will be creating chatbots um, by answering questions, uh, answering questions by calling external APIs. I think also a use case will be converting natural language, uh, unstructured natural language into structured JSON data to be processed or stored um, in some kind of back end, um, and also to extract structure um, from text data uh, for a secondary system um, to understand. Thanks.